Hi, how are you doing? Welcome back to the salon. It's been a while since I've seen you. Yeah, so let me just take a look at your hair. Wow, it's, um, it's definitely been a while because it's grown so much longer since the last time I saw you. Do you remember when the last time that you were here? Yeah, is it that long ago? Wow. Well, it's a good thing you came in because your hair needs a little bit of TLC and you've come to the right place for that. So let me just take a closer look here. It's, it's quite long now. It's much longer than it is the last time you were here. Okay. Let me just take a look here. Yes. Your hair is in definite need of some TLC. Uh, you've got a little bit of split ends and some damage on the ends especially. So, but, you know, it's not too bad. Your hair has always been fairly healthy and you take pretty good care of it. Oh, I see. Yes, so you had um, a week at the beach. That's why. That'll do it. All the sun and the salt air and the, the salt water. It can, um, it can really play havoc on the hair. So, well, I think what we should do is I have a wonderful deep cleaning shampoo and conditioner that I'm going to try, and I think we can also trim some of these split ends. You've, you've got quite a bit of extra length, so I think we could probably take off at least an inch. Is that okay? At least an inch, yes. Okay. Now, uh, I wouldn't bother with highlights or anything like that because, because you were at the beach recently, you obviously, you've got some natural highlights already in your hair. So, I would just leave it natural. I don't think we need, a, have a need for some color. Well, I don't know. I might change my mind. Let's do one thing at a time, okay? First of all, let me just detangle. Get some of the tangles out of here. Often when you spend a lot of time at the beach, the, the sort of salty air can make your hair feel coarse and um, almost like straw. 
and then you add the sun on top of it, and that will definitely add, you know, an extra level of um, problems for your hair. But it's not too bad. What I'm going to do is um, I'm just going to spray a little detangling spray in your hair, just a very light amount of conditioning, just so that I can brush through it more easily, okay? Excellent. All right, now let's see. I'm going to use a different brush. Um, this is a, a fairly new brush that a lot of the salons are starting to use, and it's sort of a detangling brush, but it also is good at smoothing out all of the damaged hair follicles. There's some sort of silicone embedded into the bristles. I'm not really sure how it works exactly, but it's quite wonderful. Let's see how it works on your hand. That's wonderful. That works pretty well. and they're quite damaged actually so I think we're going to definitely have to trim some of that off and, but as I said your hair has gotten quite long since the last time I saw you so a little bit of a trim I'm just going to use this wooden brush, and this just has metal bristles, and it's um, really good for helping to strengthen the hair. So we're just going to do that a little bit right now. It also removes the static electricity. It is sort of a little cool out. There's still just a little bit of static electricity in the air. There's not a lot of humidity yet here. So where were you, where were you at that you were at the beach? Where did you go? Oh, yes. That sounds wonderful. How long were you there? Well, that sounds like it would have been wonderfully relaxing. I've been there a few times, but it's been a while. 
I've just been so busy lately. I just haven't had time to get away. The salon has just been taking up all of my time. And, but it has been very successful. We have so many clients. We, we have a waiting list now for clients. So. And I myself have clients booked for the next eight months already. So, it's a good thing you made this appointment a long time ago. I think what I'm going to do is, first of all, cut your hair. I think we should do that first. Remove some of the damaged ends that are there. so curly still. It's so curly on the ends. There we go. Do you have any plans for the summer? Oh. Well, that sounds lovely. How long are you planning to stay? Oh, okay. Oh. Well, that's where she lives as well. So you'll have a nice visit with her. That's great. It's always good to spend time with the people that you love. Um, I just find as I get older that you have to cherish those friendships and relationships that have endured throughout time because they are everlasting until the end of your time and you need to also put some time into those relationships because if you don't they can suffer now, wait a minute, what's going on right here? A little bit of a knot right here.
I don't think I've ever seen your hair this long. It's definitely the longest it's been. Did you want to grow it out this long, or did it just get that way because you've been so busy? Busy traveling around the world. Oh, okay. Have you been to any fantastic restaurants lately? Oh. I haven't been there yet, but I have a few friends who've been there. And they absolutely loved it as well. They said the food was spectacular. saw the pictures that my friend posted on Instagram of all of the desserts that they had, and my goodness, my mouth was watering. I was like, I have to go and try those desserts, but again, just like a vacation, I have not had a lot of time. a person dull. I don't know. What is, how does that saying go? I can't remember. That's me for sure. Okay, let's see. I'm hoping to have some time to do more things this coming summer because um, a lot of clients go away for the summer, so it's, it tends to be a little quieter. But last summer was definitely one of my busiest in a long time. Even, even the summer after the pandemic was crazy, but last summer for me was just unbelievable. The salon was hopping for all through June, July, and August. And then in September, it really, it just hasn't slowed down. Actually, I think you're right. I think that perform that um, appearance that I did on Good Morning America definitely made all the difference. Because you know, not everybody gets to style and cut Cher's hair. Now I know she mostly wears wigs, but. She does have lovely hair underneath all those wigs. And, uh, anyway, she's now one of our clients here. My client in particular. So she comes in very frequently to get her hair done, and we have to take her into a special area of the salon that's a little bit more private because she just 
gets too many people wanting to take pictures with her and it can be a little distracting for her. So I said, Cher, come on back with me. We're going to go into a nice little private salon room. And in fact, I had it built just for her because, um, but I can use it for other celebrity clients who um, just want a little bit of extra privacy while they're getting their hair done. does, of course, cost more money. So, but you know, Cher has been very successful for, I don't know how long she's been in show business, at least 60 years. I don't know. It's been a long time. So, she can afford it. And she's a lovely client. We have some wonderful conversations, and let me tell you, she tells me some amazing dirt, but I promise not to say anything to anybody. Sometimes a few little things slip out here and there, though, but I try not to um, let everything out of the bag. Sometimes I hear these things on, you know, the news, so I figure, well, if it's already on the news, then I might as well tell people that I already know, and I can fill in a few extra details sometimes, too. Anyway, I'm not one to gossip. Well, not all the time. I think what I'm going to do now is um, wash and deep condition your hair before I do a nice hair oil treatment afterwards. Because as I said, your hair is quite dry and it needs, after a week on the beach, in the sun, in the salt water, your hair definitely has dried out quite a bit. So I'm going to take care of that. and. What I'm going to do is I'm going to use these, this wonderful new product that I just got into the salon. Everybody's trying to get this, and it's very hard to get, but I have a very special supplier that can send me these things. So uh, this is the Smoothest Silk Deep Moisture Gym. Doesn't that smell good? It's like mango and coconut. It's it's absolutely delicious. And I don't know if I smell banana in there as well. It's like a it's like a whole fruit bunch in there. Anyway, um, this this shampoo I've been using on my own hair, and even though I don't have a lot of hair, um, I've noticed a big difference in how silky smooth it has become since using this and I think you're gonna absolutely love this shampoo and we also have of course the um, the complimentary uh, smooth as silk deep moisture conditioner this stuff is incredible so nice. It has the same smell, actually. Isn't that nice? Yes. I. Anyway, I really absolutely love this stuff, and I think you're going to love it, too. I'm just going to recline your chair and right over here into the sink. Okay. Here we go. Okay. Are you nice and comfortable? I'm just going to wet your hair.
is wonderful. It just smells so good. I'm just going to rinse off. Now I'm just gonna put some conditioner on your hair. This lovely conditioner. Okay, we'll start with that. It smells so good. so creamy and moist. You can just feel the emollients in it. Okay. Okay, just relax and enjoy the scalp massage.
dry and now I'm just going to rinse all the conditioner out of your hair. I'm just going to towel dry your hair. There you go. Now I'm just going to sit you back up. And okay, there we go. Are you nice and comfortable? Okay, I'm just going to brush through your hair. Just to get, make sure there's no tangles left in there. Your hair is nice and damp. And this is the perfect time to use the. Um, This is the, um, the hair oil that we now use, and it's quite good. It's very expensive, but it's worth it. It's called Badger, and this one is particularly for dry and damaged hair, which you kind of have. So this hair oil doesn't take a lot. And it's all natural fragrance, so um, it smells really lovely. Okay, so I'm just going to put a little bit. Okay, let's start with that. Massage it right through. Especially the ends. so amazing. It's even, um, I've noticed it's even enhancing your natural girl as well. I think we've got all of that oil distributed throughout your hair for now. That's where the most damage is. Now, I, I 
did get rid of a lot of that damaged hair on the ends, but um, we want to make sure that the hair that's now on the end stays nice and healthy for as long as possible until you go to the beach next. Okay. Okay, let me just brush through. I'm going to use this um, nice wooden brush for this particular task. This will help distribute the oil throughout your hair as well. Wow, that's amazing. The brush just glides through your hair just like silk. Amazing. Huge difference already. This is the fine tooth comb as well, and it's just going right through your hair like butter. Like nothing at all. Nothing is holding it back. There are absolutely no tangles left in that. That is great. your hair starts to dry. Sometimes it gets a little tiny tangle at the end, but it's just temporary. Okay. All right, there we go. That looks incredible. Your hair looks it's still damp, it's not completely dry, but I can already tell it has a beautiful silky shine to it that it didn't have when you first came in here. So, yes, that was fantastic. That hair oil, all the things that I did, the, um, the shampoo, the conditioner, and the hair oil, all those products work together to bring your hair back to and it's really enhancing your beautiful natural girl as well. Alright. Alright, I think what I'm going to do now is just blow dry your hair just a little bit on a very low heat setting. And I'm just going to do that for a few minutes, and then I'm going to turn the heat off completely. And I will just finish drying it on a no-heat setting, okay? I just don't want to damage your hair, but at the same time, I want to make sure it's nice and dry, okay? Let me get my blow dryer. Here it is. Just a little bit of air to 
just to try that off. And the heat will, the small amount of heat will also help the oil penetrate your hair follicles as well. super relaxing, isn't it? I have many clients that fall asleep in the chair while I'm doing my hair, so... It's a very relaxing. see that? Look at how beautiful your hair looks now. It's like silk. Absolutely silk. Look at that. Isn't that amazing? It's amazing how you can bring it back, but it takes a professional. I'm just going to add a tiny bit more of the hair oil. There's still a tiny bit of dampness left in your hair because I just used the, the, the no heat setting mostly on your hair. And just because I don't want to dry your hair out any further. So I'm just going to add one last little bit of the hair oil. Just a tiny little bit, which is... 
is going to then just mask the hair and continue to moisturize it. Just this one little squirt of this stuff. Okay, so we'll put a little bit on this side. And a little bit on this side. That looks... Oh yeah, and it's just smooth. especially on the ends, as I keep saying. There we go. Wow. That's quite a transformation. like my work here is done. Look at your hair, girlfriend. Let me just fluff it up right here. Um, it separates beautifully into strands when you run your fingers through it right now because it looks so healthy. It's so healthy and bouncy. Look at that. Amazing. Okay. Okay. Well, you're all done. Now, is there anything that I can interest you in? Do you need any shampoo, conditioner, or anything else? Okay. Well, you can, if you want, you can buy some of the shampoo and the conditioner that I just used on you, which is amazing. This stuff right here that I showed you. We also still have the, um, this is sort of our house blend, we like to call it. And this is all natural, really wonderful um, shampoo. So I have this uh, rosemary mint, which is good for volume and thickening. Now, I don't know if you necessarily need that for your hair because your hair is already quite thick and voluminous. Volum voluminous. But it is a lovely shampoo. Smell that. Isn't that nice? It's just as a beautiful, refreshing and do it that's completely natural as well. So, these are the options. Did you want to take any? Okay, all right. The ones that I used on you? Okay, sure. And, oh, these, oh. These are just a few new soaps that I've decided to carry here in the salon because, um, 
it's weird to carry a soap in a salon because it has nothing to do with your hair. However, these soaps, which are completely 100% natural, can be used for your entire body, including your hair. And we have a lot of clients that buy these and take them if they're going on vacation or traveling. Then really all you have to do is take this and you don't have to take body wash, shampoo, other things and they also have incredible uh, moisturizing um, ingredients in them so it's almost like those three-in-one shampoos it'll do everything and you could it, you can use it on your body on your hair they're really lovely and they come in various different scents this is called tango mango this is one of my favorite ones this is called equimint which is like the rosemary mint but in the shampoo and we have one more over here oh let's see this one is vanilla orange that's also oh that's a really that's a really lovely one as well so anyway these are lovely soaps if you're interested in them. okay sure so nice to see you. Thank you for coming back into the salon. Make sure you make another appointment on your way out because, as I said, I am booked solid. But because you are a special client, we always leave a space in our schedule for our very special clients. So if you didn't make an appointment for next time, there's probably a slot available for you. Okay. All right. Wonderful to see you. Okay, go out and have fun and look fabulous while you're doing it.